A new scientific study shows that all previously proposed body forms of the gigantic megalodon, or megatooth shark, which lived nearly 15 3.6 million years ago, remain in the realm of speculations. The megalodon is typically portrayed as a supersized, monstrous shark in novels and films, such as the 2018 sci-fi film, The Meg. This new study shows that there are currently no scientific means to support or refute the accuracy of any of the published body forms of megalodon. The megalodon is known only from its teeth and vertebrae fossils, and traditionally the modern great white shark was used as a model for its body form. The great white shark belongs to the family Lamnidae, that includes the mako and salmon sharks, and they are regionally endothermic, that is, partially warm-blooded, allowing them to be active predators. The megalodon is not a lamnid shark, but it was previously inferred to also have been regionally endothermic. Previous studies used two-dimensional geometric shape analyses on the body forms of modern lamnids to propose an inferred body form of the megalodon. The new study examined whether such a two-dimensional approach can actually differentiate the body forms represented by modern warm-blooded species from those of modern cold-blooded ones in the shark order lamniforms, which includes the megalodon. The study's results suggest that the two-dimensional approach does not necessarily decisively allow the body form reconstruction, the megalodon. The fact that we still don't know exactly how the megalodon looked, keeps our imagination going, said the study's authors. This is exactly why the science of paleontology continues to be an exciting academic field. And of course, a generous source for exciting new Hollywood movies. Thank you for watching. Aisha Sinclair, for The Neutronium Alchemist. And please, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Oh, yeah.